Jessica Wilkerson talks about her experience in the championship game. Nadia Blevins shares how close the team was. I'm Juwan Holder, Wildcat News. Cheyenne Avery and Kayla Frey talk about the Key Club's most recent fundraiser, who it was for, and how much was raised. The contest was for UNICEF, and UNICEF is an organization to help raise money for other countries that don't have enough money to get an education. Uh, $98.41 was raised for the Pie in the Face contest. Dr. Coates got pied. Avery and Frey tell us about how the contest and winner were chosen and whether it will be an annual fundraiser. We decided to pie the winner and do the pie contest because it was just a way so the school would want to do it and more people would get interested in it. This is the first pie in the face contest Key Club's done and we plan to do it next year and continue to make it an annual thing. I'm Jared Spann, Wildcat News. Students express their personality through fashion. I consider fashion representing yourself and what you wear. I don't know. I guess you can see how other people dress and you compare it to your fashion. Jakim Graham talks about where he likes to shop. Uh, mainly Foot Locker. Pack sign. Um, that's pretty much it. Cause I always wear Nike shirts most of the time. Cause I wear what I want to wear. I don't care what people think. So I guess that makes it unique because a, a lot of people are picky about their fashion and what they want to wear. I'm Juwan Holder, Walk at News. Cheyenne Caswell speaks about the pet supply drive. The Wildcat Ambassadors is sponsoring a dog and cat supply drive for the Ruff organization. The Ruff organization is an adoption agency uh, to help dog and cat, dogs and cats find homes. Students like Elena Parrish, uh, Megan Mills, Kaylee Eubanks, and myself are helping.
the Do Something Club took a day to cut up old t-shirts and stuff and to make toys out of it and they're donating it. Um, I hope everyone participates and brings food and toys in for the dogs and cats and hopefully some of them will be adopted or fostered. I'm Katherine Sorrell, Wild Cat News. Tired of boring big box pizza chains? Big Al has you covered with handmade pizza, wings, and garlic nubs. I make your pizza with fresh quality ingredients right as soon as you order it. Located at 4042 behind Smithfield's Chicken and Barbecue. Big Al's Pizza and Wings, handmade for you. Ever want to be on Wildcat News? Well, now's your chance. Come to room 128 today and fill out an application. Auditions are November 14th.